Special festivities are taking place at the Korean folk village to celebrate Chuseok. Visitors can play traditional games and also make Songpyeon a delicacy enjoyed during the Thanksgiving holidays. Yi Xiu starts us off. Chuseok. It's one of the biggest holidays here in South Korea. And to celebrate the day, the Korean folk village just south of Seoul is welcoming visitors with special activities this week. The village, a replica from the Joseon dynasty and an outdoor museum, is holding a special celebration called Chuseok is Here, where visitors can immerse themselves in the traditional festivities of Chuseok. They can experience the traditional way of preparing a table full of food for deceased ancestors called Charesang. Charesang consists of abundant fruits and staples harvested in the autumn season. Another traditional characteristic of the Chuseok holiday is making songpyeon. Songpyeon is a type of rice cake with sweet fillings such as soybeans or sesame seeds and honey. Traditionally, Koreans made songpyeon with rice yet to ripen before the autumn harvest. And here you can have a try at making one yourself. Visitors, young and old, have a lot of fun making the traditional treat. In the past, autumn was a time to prepare the fabric needed for the cold winter ahead. And ladies of the household participated in silk weaving. The traditional method of making fabric involves extracting thread from cocoons of silk forms that are set afloat in boiling water. Visitors in awe at the rare site also take part in the activity. Also ahead of winter, people in the past used to thatch their roofs with straw. Straw was also used to make bags to carry grain. And there were people whose job was to fix the straw used for such purposes. Visitors who got to have a sneak peek into the past share their excitement. And we are happy to see different uh, kinds of houses, uh, traditional houses here. Uh, in addition to that, uh, they were blacksmith, goldsmith, and some uh, the way they make the mat. Uh, I, it was very interesting for me and my child, my kids. Um, it's really cool because it's also different perspective, different culture, and you can see how it was in Korea a while ago. Entrance to the village costs 32,000 Korean won for adults and 26 Korean won for children, around 23 and 19 U.S. dollars, respectively. The special holiday celebration will last until next Monday. Lee Se-hoo, Arirang News.